Hey gang, here's another extraordinary life tip. You ever feel like you're overwhelmed? What do you do when you're feeling overwhelmed? A lot of us will just shut down, want to go take a nap. We just get to the point where we just can't handle all the things that are coming at us. One of the things that I have found to be very valuable in working with others to not feel overwhelmed is to help them to understand that being overwhelmed is a choice. You don't have to be overwhelmed. You can choose not to be overwhelmed. One of the strategies we use is a concept called Stop, Challenge, Choose, a principle that Dr. Wayne Anderson came up with in his uh, Habits of Health Transformational System to help individuals to become the dominant force in their life and to not be overwhelmed by their circumstances, no matter how difficult those are. So if you begin to stop and reflect on your current decision and your current thought pattern, rather than taking on the responsibilities of everything that you're currently dealing with, challenge your thought. Challenge your thought to think about what is it that I can do today to keep myself moving forward? I don't have to worry about all the things that are going to happen in the future, or all the things that could happen and may happen. I could just take care of the day or I could take care of this next hour or the next 15 minutes. Focus on what you can do versus all the things that you have to do or that you should do. I love the phrase that says, don't should on yourself. Don't tell yourself all the things you should do. Just focus in on what you can do. Whatever you can do, do that. And then challenge yourself to do things that maybe are a little bit above and beyond what you think you can do. And what this does is that it challenges you to do a little bit more. And if you do a little bit more each and every day, you can overcome any challenge or any overwhelming circumstance. Um, it starts with the little baby steps. You got to match your current level of motivation. So if you're not motivated to do a lot, Break it down and match it up to your motivation level and take that next step and you'll become more motivated. Remember, motivation is a contraction between the word motive and action. If you take action on your motives or your ideas, you can become more motivated and you can prove to yourself that you're more confident and competent in handling overwhelming circumstances. The last part of Stop, Challenge, and Choose is choose. Choose to do something that's going to move you forward. Don't get into this concept that you can't do hard things because you're pretty amazing and you could do some amazing things with your life if you are only willing to take ownership and just start to do whatever you can do. Hope you enjoyed this video. Share it with your friends if you enjoyed it or drop a comment down below. Would love to hear your feedback.